क्वेश्चन नंबर 56 लेट्स रीड द क्वेश्चन द नंबर ऑफ लोन पेयर्स ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स प्रेजेंट इन XeF4 मॉलिक्यूल इज लेट्स ड्रॉ द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ XeF4 Xe डबल बॉन्ड O डबल बॉन्ड O डबल बॉन्ड O एंड देयर डबल बॉन्ड O स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस फिगर देयर इज नो लोन पेयर प्रेजेंट ऑन जिनन एंड ऑन ईच ऑक्सीजन two lone pairs are present i'm drawing lone pairs that means in total the number of lone pairs of electrons present is equals to 2 plus 2 plus 2 is equals to 2 into 4 which is equals to 8 That means the correct answer is option number three. Moving to next question, students, which is question number fifty-seven. Let's read the question. Molecule which is non-polar is students the molecule in which all the bond dipoles cancel out each other are non-polar. And among the given options, option number two, which is PCl five. is a non polar since all the bond dipoles cancel out each other as a result the net dipole moment is zero or we can say that the molecule is non polar that means the correct answer for this question is option number 2 going to next question which is question number 58 let's read it paramagnetic species among the following is students for this question we have to understand that if there is unpaired electrons present then that particular species is paramagnetic so in case of 1 na plus there is no unpaired electron same with mg2 plus and same with f minus but in case of phosphorus i am writing the electronic configuration phosphorus atomic number 15 this is neon 3s2 3p3 so here three unpaired electrons are present that means phosphorus is paramagnetic so answer is option number 4 going to next question students which is 59 let's read the question in which of the following pairs of molecules ions the central atom have sp3 hybridization student for the calculation of hybridization first of all we'll be calculating number of hybrid orbitals which is equals to number of bond pairs plus lone pair so after calculating number of hybrid orbitals we'll be able to calculate hybridization of central atom so here bf3 in bf3 uh, the hybridization of boron is sp2 and here in ch4 the hybridization of carbon is sp3 going to next nh2 minus and ch4 student here i'm drawing the structure of nh2 minus nitrogen has two lone pairs and two bond pairs that means number of hybrid orbitals is equals to 4 as a result the hybridization is sp3 the hybridization of ch4 we have already discussed here carbon has four bond pairs that means number of hybrid orbitals is equals to 4 and hybridization is sp3 here sf6 student sf6 has six bond pairs therefore hybridization of sulfur is sp3d2 going to next xcf2 here zinn has three lone pairs and two bond pairs as a result number of hybrid orbitals is 5 and hybridization is sp3d going to next xcf2 we have already discussed the hybridization of zinn is sp3d and here we have already discussed the hybridization of carbon in ch4 is sp3 so the pair of ions or molecules where the central atom is sp3 hybridized is option number 2 so the correct answer is option number 2 going to next students which one of the following species does not exist under normal conditions so student if the bond order is 0 the particular species will not exist so let's calculate the bond order in option number 1 the bond order of h2 is 1 that means this exists 
moving to next the bond order of h2 plus is 0.5 moving to next h e 2 plus the bond order is also 0.5 and the last is li2 2 plus and the bond order here is 0 that means option number 4 li2 2 plus does not exist so answer is option number 4 Moving to next question students.